Hi everybody, welcome to Van and Boss. Today we'd like to show you a short video of how to operate our super low profile stealth pop top and hopefully answer some frequently asked questions. We can also point out some of our other products which are available on the website at vanandbus.co.uk. If you'd like to come this way, we're going to have a look inside the bus. Right then folks, here we are in the van. So, take a look to my right, we've got a low level kitchen unit on this van. Uh, in the top here we've got a little top loading fridge. Very handy for your drinks and anything you want to keep cool on your trips away. We also do high level units or low level units, all available on the website, vanandboss.co.uk. Okay, as you can see here, what I'm sat on is a three quarter rock and roll bed. Incredibly easy to operate, uh, really comfortable. You can go away for days on end on this, you will not struggle. If you want something a little bit different, the glide bed is available, also on the website, vanandboss.co.uk. Have yourself a look. Okay, we've done in here, so what we'll do now, we'll go outside and I'll show you the roof operation. Okay, follow me. So, Stealth B2 is available for the Transporter T5 through to C6.1. We also have a Stealth FTC option, which is available for the Ford Transit Custom. If you follow me this way, we'll show you how the B2 works. Right there, people, here we are. First step in the B2 roof is to undo the rear locking bolts. So we remove them completely times two. There's one. I might as well do the other. There we go. Just give me a sec. And there's your number two. Not, not doesn't take long at all. Right, now we'll go around to the front and we'll do uh, the other latches. But before we do that, I just need to remind you that on the transit, we have a slightly different option, which is a T-handle latch. Slightly different way of operating. Just as secure, just as good. Right, let's go around the front. Right then, people. Now we'll do front latch operation. We've got two latches in the front, both behind the sun visors. Very simple operation. Here we have the key. There you go, you pull the sun visor down. Key in, half a turn, you'll feel the latch let go. It is that simple. There's one either side, under each visor. Okay. So, all four latches open. We come inside, we need to remove the hatch. Very simple operation. Two clips, down she comes, across to one side and out. Very simple. Now, to push the pop top up, two hands, one either side, gently push, and the hatch will go up all on its own. Okay. Right then, guys, so the roof's now up. Next step, we push the bedboard, and up it goes, giving plenty of room to get changed, have a look around, whoever what you want to do. Next step, pull the bedboard down, climb up, very easy, up you go. And just so you know, there's plenty of room in here. We have a range of mattresses that can stay in here full time. And I'm six foot, so you can see there's plenty of room. So here we are, guys. I'm sat up top, sat in the T. This is the scenic tent option, as you can see. It opens fully to give you full panoramic views of wherever you set yourself up for the night, the weekend, or your long stay. Um, absolutely great bit of kit. The next thing I'd like to point out is our patented mechanism. Now this patented bespoke mechanism, which we have here, is what allows us to make the slimline roof so low profile without affecting headroom in the cabin when the roof is closed. Ideal for the taller person. Right then, now we're going to show you how the pop-top closes. Very simple operation. First step, reach up, grab hold of the two straps. Pull gently, pull it down, you'll feel it meet its equilibrium point. When it does, you stop there, you can let go of the straps. You grab the tent, you pleat the tent in from the front, both sides, pull it in gently, and grab all your two straps, continue pulling down, and that is the lid closed. Then you would fit your hatch afterwards, tuck the straps up inside, job done. Right guys, simple operation to get these latches closed. Uh, we'll go to the fronts first. There's your key, put your key in the hole. Now it's 180 degrees, but what you may feel, before you turn the 180, you may want to put your hand on the front and just make sure the roof is located in its, in its holder. Do the 180 and you'll feel the roof pull down. Repeat on the other side and that's the front of the roof fully, lock, fully locked down. Okay, and the final step, we get the two rear latch, latch bolts and we locate them here and here, screw them in position, that's your roof fixed down. Okay guys, that was a Stealth B2 operation. It's pretty much the same for the FTC, which is the Ford Transit Custom option. I'd like to thank you for your time today. Any more info is available on the website, vanandboss.co.uk.